camera died so I'm gonna vlog on my phone hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Dina of Dindin's Adventures I'm not sure if I introduced myself I am a bit tired we just arrived in Doha we're going to try and leave the airport and see the pearl of Doha and the skyline from the beach and then come back in time to catch our next flight to our official destination um oh no not no we still have to go back hey guys um hope you guys can hear me apparently i look like a tired hun that sucks <laughs> But I am tired. Energy on zero. Um, we arrived at Doha. Uh, I don't know what the airport is called. Do you know what it's called? It's called. Oh. Okay, so it's gonna check. I mean, we arrived at the airport at about five, their local time, five o'clock, which meant it was four o'clock in SA then we tried to leave the airport by immigrations to go and check out the that's the word that i'm looking for to go and check out like the town oh we had hamad international airport there we go hamad so we tried to leave the airport to go because we have a nine hour layover so i thought we'd do like pearl of, Do pearl of doha and then there's another place where you can like do the skyline of Doha in the evening, which is what's gonna what was gonna work. So we're just gonna see the opulence and the money people, you know, people just living like, their best lives of money. Then we'll see the skyline, then come back. And in the time that we're going to take to run around, it was going to be travel for about two hours then we're gonna give ourselves two hours so an hour in each place um, then we'd have like a grace period of an hour when we get back to the airport to go to our gate but so when we got to the immigration officer she says to us uh, oh yeah you guys need a PCR test and a COVID certificate like we have COVID certificates she's like no we need both and we were just like but nobody told us it's not even like I don't even think it's online so that's one thing that you guys need to learn from this video that if you are having a layover in Doha and you want to explore the city you need to do a PCR test it's 500 rand or a tambo and then so you need to have the results before you leave the country in Sarah, right um i'm not sure if they allow you on the plane if it's positive child <laughs> that's at your own risk because you can be asymptomatic positive but anyway i'm not here to scare you guys i'm just here to tell you that we've been waiting um impatiently um where's my phone so I'm still vlogging on my phone because I'm too lazy to charge to charge my how do you call this thing camera. to charge my camera and it's literally just here let me show you how far away it is like literally just like. but I'm singing I'm done I'm out I'm out for the day. I'm finished. I just, I want a bed to sleep in. Guys, did I tell you that yesterday we got home at 11? Eh? Yeah. <laughs> and then we packed, and then only at 12 we'll be in bed. And then when we we're in bed, it was also a thing of we need to wake up and bath. And it was just like, no. And we're like, we're going to get up at 3. Ah ah! Got up at like quarter, half past four. Four-ish, quarter past four, -ish. Quarter past four. Only left for the airport at around five, so we had to run. We had to like literally run. We don't have time to go through like anything actually properly at the airport. But I think it's also a blessing. Um, and I also want to think that us not being able to go through 
to the city today is also another blessing in disguise and I'm gonna stay hopeful gonna stay patient I can't wait to get on that flight deep so never because I swear this person yeah, one of those person that I'm with this one here he was literally in the flight for 10 minutes as we're taking off guys this person not as we took off I went I, I slept <laughs> in the but you were sleeping like i'm sure the first leg was up and you're gone the front leg of the airplane was up and you were like i no it's not I, for I, me I slept, I slept when we started cruising mm -mm. I promise you. you had been sleeping too i slept when we started cruising you were sleeping when like hit, netflix was watching you that's how bad it when was we hit, when we hit cruising altitude, a whole season of a show watched you sleeping dude how do you mean? Yeah, I, I, I'm not disputing that. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, sure. I'm not disputing that I slept most of the flight, but I'm just saying I didn't sleep 10 minutes when I slept 20 minutes in. Guys, tell me why this lady in front of me, who's sitting in front of me, reclines her seat five minutes into the flight. Like, we're not even cruising, but she's reclined. We haven't even had lunch, she's reclined. So... Where will I put my juice? Yo, guys. Breakfast. Some people. Hmm? You haven't had breakfast? Dude, she, it, it was just so inconsiderate. Oh, yeah, by the way, Qatar versus Etihad. Qatar. You know what? For the food. Because, wow. The breakfast was really nice, ne? Both meals. Oh, yeah, breakfast was really nice. No, they are the, pie. The was, was like very, very light because I guess they figured we were almost at the airport. Hey, they are pie. Uh -huh, guys. <laughs> so it was a potato or chicken pie and they called it a sandwich. But it was a pie. Right? And then he's ignoring me. Anyway, let me take out of my video. Yes, it was. Uh -uh. What's wrong with uh -uh. Leave me alone. Look up in her nose. Look up in her nose. Oh, why are you doing Look that? Look up in her nose. Stop. I'm tired. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Um, so, for breakfast, I think it'll be in the video. But, oh, my goodness. I would recommend 10 out of 10. Very expensive breakfast. But, <laughs> would recommend. And the goodies that they came, they gave us, that was also really nice and appreciated. Um, the stuff was also friendly, I guess. So, yeah, hence I said, I guess. They don't speak to us, we don't speak to them. Yeah, we don't really engage with each other, so. Oh, some Colombo. What's the difference between Colombo and Colombia? Oh, Sri Lanka Airlines. Oh, hectic. Okay. Yeah, so we are leaving here at 2 a.m., five minutes past two. We don't know where our boarding gate is because it's not on the tickets. So I guess we're gonna have to walk back in that direction there. Um, let me, are you guys seeing me back here and go look at like the screen to say? Yeah, the screen will tell us where exactly it's gonna be. I've been talking to you guys for like a good eight minutes, so. Bye. <laughs> I'm gonna try and nap like this, guys. My my napping situation is so sad because, like, legit, <laughs> everything is so expensive. A bag of Skittles was literally two hundred rand. I was like, mm. they were really big Skittles, but I was like, also, mm, two hundred rand. And then we had to buy food because I was hungry. We were both hungry, and when we get hungry, obviously we get grumpy. That's not something we need. Um, tired and grumpy. Ooh, imagine some the worst dude, ever. somebody just looks at you wrong and then you are there jumping up at them and you know you don't want to be having situations in places like this because of this thing of mine and also the fact that I am this and also the fact that I am not a male so you don't want to be catching situations so it was better to eat so we had burger king was it not 500 rand for both burgers like normal whoppers like whoppers eh? whoppers and then we <laughs> yo guys we am tired
so then we did the conversion to rides in our heads and on the phone then the medium meal you pay an extra four is it it's not euro is that what is it but like their currency you add four which is four times the south african rand so it was about 16 rand extra right for the medium meal and we went for that instead of getting the large meal which was five times like five of their i'm gonna say dirhams because i'm tired i'm sorry you guys have to forgive me like how one one extra four rand like 20 rand like the, guys but anyway um i guess we're here man waiting for boarding board because I'm definitely gonna I just want to nap. And I legit feel like I'm gonna end the video here. Or I'm gonna end it when I'm boarding. So that it's not too long because I've rambled on. And. Doesn't she look cute? She looks tired. She gorgeous. Oh. <laughs> What did they say? Baza kuchele kuto mushe unona kenyweit laba laba these ones these ones. Okay, so die again. Ah ah. No mushe. Okay, it's time for a fight now, guys. We'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs>